top side, he's actually able to catch Kazix here. Yeah, Kazix could be in trouble. Next, they're just gonna wait. Oh, Kubon decides to go down, but the dredge line will land. Have they got enough damage here? Kubon forced a flash, but Rumble's gonna follow him in. Kick is, is he gonna be able to pick up the kill and the blue buff? Hey, why is he not hit level five by now? As they are gonna jump in on top of him. The Ignite is down, there's the equalizer coming in. Have they got the damage? No, but Karthus will have here. Coming through, Charu picks up the kill, but Moops has got involved in the top lane. Gets himself one. Can he get the second? The charm not. And Karthus is coming down here on the bottom side. The taunt is gonna land. Mook's now in trouble as the wall of pain gets him, and he's not escaping that one. In the story of the series so far, as we do see the blue not taken away, is Charu gonna. Oh, it does get it stolen. Was stolen. Yeah, it was stolen there by the equalizer of just tormenting his former teammates at this stage. But here comes Kuban, gonna go in towards kick is the Char uh, Karthus ultimate, gonna come in there from Charu. Have they got enough damage? And the harpoon is gonna slow down Kuban. And I'll tell you what, Kuban might not get out of this one alive here. He will go down a kill. Trash Evil just running very quickly. Is a Karthus Ultra coming in? Yeah, Karthus Ultra here just to force them back, but Kikis has managed to take down Koop as well in the process. What all the action focus here on the bottom lane. Here comes Moop. Zyra ultimate will go down and Moop's as low. He's finished off. AOD now the target is Charu will have to switch around surely for this one. They go in towards Fushop. Charu is now on a rampage. From he won't have that cooldown, he won't have that energy. Leave it, leave it getting caught though, and he's not gonna escape. Wow, Dexter pulled him completely away there. Oh, will he? And he, he's gonna try and run away from this one. Bullet time will actually finish off the kill, and Charu took a lot of damage from that. Death charge comes in as well. Kill him. There we go. <laughs> they left it actually for Fushaw. That was nice to distribute. By Dexter right inside of the pit is Kubon. Gonna go aggressive here. Shen gonna get involved as well. They are gonna dive in on towards Fushaw. Here comes the ulti out of Karthus. Fushaw gonna be melted. There's a reset. Can they get Dexter down as well? He's going very low. The snipe not quite gonna land in his equalizer. Well, like that top turret, I don't think they've even done much damage there. As Moops here in trouble in the middle lane. He's gonna have to use a charge out of his ultimate to try and get away. But look at the damage of Kikis. Now, to almost nothing. The Meteor Makers are gonna sneak it away. What a play out of the poles. That will put them ahead. It looks like they want to barrel down this middle lane. They have the reach in from Baron. There goes the taunt. Wall of Pain going in. Everything going in here. This wow. is going to be a big fight as the bullet time has done work. But Karthus in the middle of them is going to put the ultimate off now. Fushout going to lose a lot of health as we will see a triple kill for Misfortune. Bullet spin roots coming out. But will it be enough? Dexter is going to catch Mackler and he's been hit by the turret. Oh, Fushout the gets that one. Can he get the Penta? Oh, a grasping root comes down. Lift out to turret. Here comes the rest of the team though. Looks like me, you make Makers might want to fight again. That's a great equalizer. Bullet time is going to shred Makata down. There with a strangle. But there's a grab on towards Charu. He's going to put the defile on and try and get as much damage out as he can. And there is also the ultimate out of Barrison, to be honest. It's Karthus ultimate. The fight going to be a bit split up for this one. But Charu going to be doing a lot of damage here as he goes in. Where's his focus going to be? They probably need to get overall towards Fushop. There's a crescendo coming out. Misses again. Fushop is going to get his GA pop. Charu. I'm honestly not sure why he backed away from that one then. I mean, his ult is going to go off and get himself the kill there. Nice. Get himself. Yeah. The equalizer goes down. There's a wall of pain, but they catch Jaru out anyway. Next is a little bit away from his team, but the bullet time comes across for Shendo as well, but they've locked him up here. That's a bonus. His ultimate and Fusho is going to die. There's a double kill for Karthus. Here comes the ultimate. Moops is not quite going to block the damage. His Zonyas was a little bit missed time there, and now Zonyas comes out of kickies. He will die straight afterwards here to Makala and Libic. Almost took Libic with him in the end, and that will be to AOD is the last. Uh, is the first man, sorry, that's gonna come up from this one, Misfortune. It may be your inhibitor turret to save your another inhibitor, because if you lose two or two of them, you know, it's it's not a good chance. I don't think Dexter is actually evil. They've got enough to hold on to this one as they are gonna dive in. Mook's gonna Zonya's up right at the last second. And Fu, uh, Fu Shop can't really go in there for that one. We do see Makla take the kill. The inhibitor is gonna die. And are they, are they still going for it? Because we know that Without that misfortune at the forefront, they probably can't do too much here. As we do see them going in there, the crescendo lands onto only Libic. And actually, the bullet time is going to catch out Charu. He's going to ulti in for this one. Who's he going to kill? He's going to take down one of them. Ulti comes out from Zyra. Have they got any more? Chain of Corruption lands. Meet your makers. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to pull this one out here. You know, they've done a good couple of amounts of damage. But Fushar base, they are surely going to finish off <laughs> Libic. Yeah, it was a double up, actually from uh, Fushop that got that kill. Makata is trying to get away. May try in vain though, but we do see Kazix jumping over, tries to jump away, dies in midair.
Double kill for Misfortune. Gonna give this one up, but he might just be dead by the time they get anyway. They cannot defend against those waves of super minions. They have to fight here and it might be it. Wall of Pain goes down. Dexter is actually evil. We'll go in there. Crescendo actually hit a couple of them. The equalizer's good. Bullet time actually was stopped there in the end. As a uh, chain of corruption comes in there as well. Charu is gonna die, but he's died right on top of them. Full shop. Is he gonna go down? Carthus ulti coming in, but they survive it crucially here. The inhibitor on that bottom side as we are gonna see Kikis go flashing in, but look at the damage he's taking. Macklin's gonna pick up that one. He will die here in the end. Oh, Willie? Willie, as the Zonyas is popped finally. Yeah, and they're gonna have a problem with that as time goes on, but each breakers are gonna go for some inhibitor turret. We do see the ultimate coming out onto Charu, but oh, the crescendo coming in. Crescendo's good. It's actually caught two of them there as the equalizer. They're burning to death, and the bullet time comes in as well. Oh, is Carthus ulti gonna get kills? No, it's not. They've hardly lost any health. They are gonna see them push through. Wow, great play there coming out off Kubon as he jumps in. A little bit longer in this game. Incredible. The problem is, though, if they ever leave their base with fire, they're gonna open the kill SE. How does it comes down? Looks like they're actually gonna rush it right now. They're gonna rush it. That's what they're going for. They're gonna go straight in towards the Nexus. Equalizer goes down. Are they gonna go for a fight first? No, look at Kazix at the back there. They're they are hitting it. it. They're gonna kill this Nexus right here. Meet your makers. Take down Dex.